What's up, savages? Another 75 hard update. I'm on day 29 now, so about four weeks in. I don't plan on failing. We're going to conquer this. It's smooth like butter. Last video, I was struggling. It was hard. But now, it's like it just goes. You go outside, yeah. You got another workout tonight? Yeah, it's easy. I got to take that picture? Okay. Read 10 pages? Let's get it. That's my favorite part. I'm enjoying that. I went to a Super Bowl party, there's pizza everywhere, there's wings. I had to bring my own food. But there, it was like there was no question now. On week two, that last video when I said I was struggling, it was always a battle like, ah oh, man, come on, I don't want to do this yet. I don't. Now you're just so far in, it doesn't matter. It's easy. The battle's over. So in the last two weeks, what I've learned from this challenge is that consistency leads to big results. If you just continue to show up, you get big results. That's, that's what I keep thinking about for this video. I'm not seeing crazy big changes with my, with my body or my physique, but I'm going to the gym and I'm seeing a little more definition. In spots that I haven't seen before, I'm like, oh, okay, I like that. That's a small victory, that's a small win. I'm noticing that I'm more vibrant, I'm more energized. I feel like I'm just stronger, you know, like my muscles feel dense, I'm eating healthy. There's nothing going in my body that's disturbing. This challenge has been amazing. There's been days where it's been snowing, it's been 17 degrees outside. And there's no question, we're going out. I was listening to Andy Frisella talk about going outside when it's disgusting out. He must be doing the 75 hard challenge right now too. But he's outside walking in the snow and he's talking about how going outside when it's nasty out, freezing cold, it's snowing, you don't want to be out there. That's uncomfortable as hell. But it's a parallel with life because there's always going to be those goals that we have and we're just waiting for the right time, the right opportunity to jump in, to take action, to do it. But there's never a right time. We have to do it right now when we're, when we're not ready. When the weather is not perfect. Because those struggles and the uncomfortable times is what makes you a winner. It's what makes you succeed. If we just keep waiting for the right moment, we'll never do it. We'll never take action. So this video is all about taking action and being consistent. Just continue to show up. And great things will come from it. You might see the smallest results, like the little muscles I'm seeing on my arms. It's the smallest changes. I'm not seeing crazy results in my abs yet, but I'm seeing some new definition that I haven't seen in a while. And I'm loving it, every second of it. Acknowledge those small wins in whatever you're doing. I get a new subscriber, I'm like, heck yeah, what's up baby, let's get it. Thank you so much for watching. You know, just celebrate the small victories. I don't know what else I wanna say because this, the last two weeks, it's been good. I'm trying to think of like one struggle. All right, let me get real, real quick. So the one struggle that I've had in the last two weeks, I say it's smooth like butter because the process is just going now. We're in it. But it's, now it's about balancing my time. I'm putting a lot of time into the 75 hard. I'm actually working out a little longer because I'm just feeling energized and I like to do this. But I'm also doing the YouTube thing. I'm also working with my clients. I also have other business things that I, I must do. But that, that's not the only areas of my life. I have, a, I have a wonderful relationship that I need to take care of to make sure that's still good. It's not her problem that I'm putting myself through some, some, some stuff, so I better balance my time. It's not my house's problem that I have a lot of other things to do. I better take care of my house. It's not my bank account's problem. I better take care of my bank account. I better be saving some money. See, there's other areas that we must keep a watch on. You know what I'm saying? So that's the one struggle maybe that I've had in the last two weeks is to keep a balance on my relationship. Making sure I'm still putting time there into some other work things, into my finances. But other than that, it's now we got it under control. But don't get too comfortable. The other night I was real comfortable. I usually take my 
progress pic after the shower and I wasn't I didn't have to shower at night this time. And I'm going to bed like, yeah, another day, we're killing it. And I was like, no, my picture. Had to run and take the picture real quick. Thankfully, it popped in my head right before I fell asleep. Because if you fall asleep, you have to start from day one. Don't get too comfortable. It takes discipline to remember all these things and to focus on every task that you have each day. But that's why we're doing this, so that we can get better at business, so that we can be more productive, so that we can have that mental toughness that it takes to break our bad habits, to take action, to go after our goals. Join the Success Army, hit that subscribe button for me, and let's get after it. I'm here to ignite your passion, be you, and be different. Peace and one love, always.